As a part of our presentation of Hindu shrines and temples in our Indian Pilgrim Tours Bharat Tirath Yatra YouTube channel, we present about Mahalakshmi Temple Ritlam. Deek or lamp is the embodiment of Lakshmi Devi. Diwali is an invitation to that mother amidst many lights. People will not start auspicious activities on no moon day. But all the people consider Diwali is an auspicious day to worship Goddess Lakshmi and get blessings from the Goddess. As per Hindu mythology, Goddess Lakshmi goes out at dusk on Diwali and stops at the houses of those who regularly worship the deity and blesses the people who help others. Goddess Lakshmi enters the home of those who help others with bestowed wealth. The house is always resplendent with Lakshmi decorated with colorful designs in front of the house, mango arches, turmeric and saffron with the entrance of Goddess Lakshmi. The worship room should be decorated with garlands in the morning of Diwali. A yellow cloth with swastika symbol should be placed on a wooden pedestal in front of the worship room and a copper urn poured inside with water, coins, rose petals and swastik symbol marked coconut should be placed on the urn. Turmeric Ganesha should be prepared and worshipped by lighting lamp. The idol of the goddess should be anointed with Panchamrit and twelve lamps should be lit in earthen pots with sesame oil. Goddess Lakshmi bestows blessings of longevity on the devotees worship the goddess with lotus flowers, roses and akshita, turmeric rice, and offer sesame oil dishes wearing the akshita after worship. Goddess Lakshmi bless the devotees who worship in this way on Diwali. There is Bhagyalakshi Devi Temple in Hyderabad with Golden Idol and Golden Temple of Ma Lakshmi in Velour, Tamil Nadu. But unlike these temples, the Mahalakshmi Temple at Ritlam in Madhya Pradesh distributes money and jewelry as prasad to devotees. There is no other temple in the country other than Ritlam Mahalakshmi Temple that adorns Goddess Mahalakshmi with gold, silver ornaments, diamond jewelry and cash. Ritlam is connected with all parts of the country by rail. Ritlam is at a distance about 100 km from Ujjain. Omkareshwar and Mahakaleshwar Jyoti Ling visitors can travel from Ujjain to Ritlam which is well connected by rail and visit the temple. The temple is about 3 km from Ritlam railway station near Manek Chok police station in the center of town. There are medium to high class hotels near Ritlam railway station for accommodation and dining. Devotees believe that whatever is offered in the Mahalakshmi temple at the beginning of the year will be doubled at the end. The temple is crowded especially on Diwali. People come to the temple before Diwali, carrying currency and ornaments with devotion. The deposited currency and jewelry are registered and token is issued. Devotees who visit the temple after Diwali are given cash and ornaments as prasad. In medieval times bundles of notes and jewelry are kept in the temple itself. The specialty of the temple is that before Diwali, devotees deposit precious ornaments and cash with devotion and get them back after the festival is over. Devotees come here from far off places for prasad. Mahalakshmi temple is beautifully decorated during Diwali. The temple has valuable jewelry worth about 100 crore rupees. Looking at the decorations in the sanctum, it seems that such valuable money and jewelry have been donated to the temple. But it is hard to believe that the devotees will give it as a gift to decorate the temple and then give it back to them. Devotees consider prasad as an auspicious sign and keep it safe without spending it. The temple doors are opened only once a year on the auspicious day of Dhanteras during Brahma Mahot. The doors open on Dhanteras day will remain open till after Diwali. Diwali festival is celebrated in the temple for five days with great pomp. Devotees who bring ornaments to the temple to adorn Goddess Mahalakshmi are believed to have a happy home. It is auspicious to keep Kuberu Prasad packets containing Sri Yantra, Kauris, Akshatas, coins and Kankum at home for women. The specialty of the temple is that there is no mistake in the accounts of the jewels worth lakhs of rupees deposited by the devotees so far. Devotees offer gold and silver ornaments worth crores of rupees and other gifts to the temple every year. A portion of the gold and silver offered to the goddess during Diwali are distributed to the devotees in the form of prasad. Gold and silver is not considered as a form of jewellery and is prasad with blessing of goddess Lakshmi. Each offering made to the goddess is recorded and refunded so that the authorities know how much gold to return as prasad. For those who visit the temple, the sound of the bells in the temple brings joy to the mind and creates a peaceful feeling with the spiritual atmosphere. The bustling shops around the temple offer artifacts and souvenirs that reflect the beauty of the city of Ritlam. 
Only traditional clothes should be worn. Skimpy clothing is prohibited. Photography and videography are allowed. Visiting timings are from 6 a.m. to 11.30 p.m. There is no entrance fee. We request our viewer to subscribe our channel besides sharing to friends and relatives. Give support to our growth. Have a good day.